Hey guys, it's Michael, your expert caddy, and today I wanted to go through my entire golf bag, show you guys what clubs I'm playing. I just got fitted for them last summer, so I'm really excited to show you. I'll show you all my clubs, the bag, everything inside of it, and I'm gonna hit every single club, show you how far I hit each club. So it should be a fun video. Make sure to subscribe if you're new so you don't miss out on another video. Leave a like and let's get into it. So I'll start out with the bag that's holding all of our important tools. I got the tailor-made Flex Tech Ultralight bag. I actually really like this bag. It's pretty new. I just got it. Um, this summer it's got really nice pockets super super light when carrying it out in the course i usually walk sometimes ride but when you walk these straps are super comfortable it's got great pockets um, as you'll see we got a pocket over here for your valuables i put my phone wallet keys over here then you have this kind of extra little sneaky pocket on the side currently i don't keep anything over here but I mean, you could fit more valuables, kind of stuff like that. Got my rangefinder in the top of that. Then we go down over here to where I keep all my balls. I have way too many balls in here right now. But if you're not walking, you can kind of carry a ton if you want to, you know, mess around a little bit on the course. Flipping it around this way, we got favorite pouch in the entire world, my snack pouch. You know, got some pretzels in here, got a cliff bar, you know, got to stay fueled up out on the course. Really good handle here, nice plastic handle. And overall, really solid bag, like I said, super light really like this tailor-made bag let's get into my other clubs because kind of have a mixed bag of things i think you guys enjoy it a bunch of different brands so let's get into the old tools in the bag so we're going to start off with the wedges i got voki sm9 wedges 60 degree 56 and 52 in the all black face i really like these things i mean i always have played vokis probably had four or five sets at this point but these are great really trusty for myself by titleist i really like these so i just decided to stick with the vokis Really like the black finish, first time having the black finish. This is kind of where we get a little mixed bag of things. So we had Titleist wedges. Now we got Mizuno irons. I got the Mizuno Pro 221s, pretty much pure blades. When I went into my fitting, I didn't really expect to get fit for blades, but when the fitter said that I could, I really like the look of these. These were like one of the last clubs that I hit actually, and kind of fell in love with them. The contact is great. Never ever had a Mizuno club before, but got the Mizuno Pros right here in the irons. Got extra stiff shafts in these, the Project X LZ 6.5, 125 grams. Finally playing extra stiff shaft in my irons. I was playing stiff beforehand, never got fit for clubs before. If you wanna check out the fitting video, I'll link it in the description. Also see how I got fit for all these clubs, but really like the shafts in these. I mean, these things are absolutely pure. Got the pitching wedge through four iron here. Really, really like these irons. Okay, now for hybrid slash utility, I have a two iron, Titleist U500, two iron, hazardous smoke, extra stiff shaft right here. I used to have a hybrid, but I didn't switch to a two iron. I felt like I couldn't miss as much with an iron off the tee rather than a hybrid. So went with a two iron, absolutely love this thing. Go to off the tee, tight fairway, super reliable, get up there, kind of rip it. We'll get distances in all these clubs after I'm done talking about them. So now we're going into the wood section. Now I used to have a three wood, but now I have this TaylorMade Stealth Plus five wood. 19 degrees, tune it down to like 18, 17 ish, probably about 17 degrees. Reason is, I was hitting my three wood too far and I couldn't hold any greens going into par five. So, have the five wood now. First time having the five wood and extra stiff shaft, low spinning, of course. I've had tailor made woods in the past. You know, I had the sim beforehand. This is the stealth and new stuff. Really like it. Great look, all black. And yeah, love the five wood here. Now, moving into the big dog, the stealth driver had a sim beforehand in the driver as well but when i got fit for the stealth plus here got the ventus 7x velo core extra stiff shaft was having trouble with it uh to start but i got used to it it's eight degrees tuned down to 6.25 degrees so that kind of just tells you how high it actually hit it you got to keep it low spinning but this thing absolutely rips i was gaining distance non-stop with this thing even more so than my sim than i had before then but this is a monster off the tape if i can get it going straight let's talk about the flat stick got this sick head covered by swag golf love that thing and i got fit for this too scotty cameron phantom x 5.5 completely milled kind of that fang look put a super stroke grip on here just like this grip a little better and yeah i was unsure about this when i got fit for a putter but i have some scotties at home before this, I was using a tailor-made spider, which I really liked, but yeah, this one has a little bit more toe hang than my putter, which was face balanced. Yeah, I really like this thing. Great alignment over the top with this fun fang look. Kind of unique, but the sound it makes coming off this thing is great. Now let's get into all of the clubs, hitting them. How far do I actually hit them? Let's go, I'll put the distances up on the screen. Let's uh, cue to that.
that's all the clubs in my bag and what I'm playing right now. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe so you don't miss another one. Leave a like and I'll see you in the next one.